Strong Style Evolved is in the books. What a night here in Long Beach. Walter Pyramid, I'm Kevin Kelly. I am proud to be joined by the number one wrestling journalist for seemingly forever, Dave Meltzer. Well, thank you very much for the introdu introduction. We uh, we hadn't seen each other in 20 years yeah. before yesterday at the dojo, and now here we are working together. Amazing, isn't I it? I love it. Yeah. Um, okay, so of course, if you didn't get a chance to see tonight's event live, you we, must. Will, we will go through <laughs> the event, we'll talk about the results, so there will be spoilers here. So if you don't want to listen to spoilers, watch us afterward, because this is going to be good stuff. Uh, and that will begin in three, two, 39 minutes and 23 seconds of a main event. Roughly. Jesus. Yeah. Kenny Omega, Kota Bushi, the Golden Lovers, victorious over the Young Bucks. What were you thinking sitting there watching as you're as you're reporting on the show? I mean, it was it was there were so many different thoughts. I thought that they they were they were so um, you know you could tell how driven they were. They knew that the pressure was on because everybody was expecting this blow away match. And they, they delivered it. It was extremely creative. It was long. It was um, all kinds of crazy moves and a, lot, a hell of a lot of drama. Yeah, I appreciated the drama a great deal in addition to the amazing athleticism because Kenny went into this match saying uh, to us on New Japan World that he really didn't want this match, that it was inadvertent when he said, hey, we're the best tag team in the world. That's where Matt took exception. They move up to heavyweight, and the match is made for tonight. Every bit worthy of this sold-out crowd. Uh, we'll talk more about that in a little bit. I want to get your thoughts quickly about Switchblade, Jay White, Hangman Page. I thought that exceeded expectations far and away. Well, that was another one. Those, now, those guys had a lot of pressure on them because they were following, you know, they were following Okada. Mm -hmm. And, every, you know, people here came, and Okada is on, you know, Okada's perhaps the best wrestler in the world. You've got Zack Sabre on an incredible role. You've got Ishii and Suzuki. When they were in the ring, the place was going electric. And those guys had to follow, and they it took them a while to get the crowd. Mm -hmm. But they did get the crowd, and they worked so hard. You know, I mean, you could see that um, they knew that they knew they were in a tough position, and they delivered. Rey Mysterio, of course, joined us here tonight, uh, disappointed that he couldn't have the match with Jushin Thunder Liger because of the torn bicep. Instead, Will Ospreay gets the opportunity to showcase, and he did just that. Amazing match between he and Liger. But then it seemed like Mysterio has more to think about than just uh, a match down the road with Jushin Liger. Yeah, he, you know, I mean, Will Ospreay wanted to wrestle him. They've um, they've wrestled before. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I mean, for a guy like Will Ospreay, whether it's Jushin Liger or Rey Mysterio, I mean, these are the guys that he idolized when he was growing up. So it's a, it's got to be a thrill for him to, to do that singles match tonight and um, a thrill for him to work with Rey Mysterio, especially on a major show, um, you know, Major New Japan show, wherever that ends up being. Right, and throw Will, uh, throw uh, Marty Skrull in the mix as well. So whether, and I talked to Ray afterward, we'll hear from him very soon on New Japan World. Uh, he wants to wrestle Jushin Liger first, feels he oh, owes okay. it to the fans. Uh, then Osprey and the junior title, if that's what awaits him, fine. And he said he will be very patient to look to get even with Marty Skrull. So you'll hear from Rey Mysterio coming up in the next few days on New Japan World. Um, I do want to go over quickly with Okada, Zack Sabre Jr., and we go to Sakura Genesis. Uh, you mentioned the role that, that Zack is on right now. It's, Tap, it's incredible. Submitting four of the best on the road to winning the New Japan Cup. Now he goes in against Okada, greatest uh, champion in the modern age. Yeah. Uh, and where do you see this match going? Well... If, it's, if it stays on the mat, I mean, that's that's Zack Sabre's world. Um, if Okada can keep it standing and keep distance, um, that's not Zack Sabre's world. So it's, I think that one of the things, one of the stories of all of those matches that were held during the New Japan Cup is that Zack Sabre made everyone else wrestle his match. Mm -hmm. And Okada is usually really good at making people wrestle his match. So that's that's part of the key to the match. But there's, there's a lot of drama because, um, you know, I mean, to win a championship at that level by submission, the IWGP title, um, and, and Zach's groundwork is just, it's, it's mind-blowing. It's mm -hmm. incredible. Somebody's going to beat Okada. Sometime his title reign will end. Will it be April the 1st at Sakura Genesis? We'll have all the coverage uh, from Sumo Hall live right here at NJPWWorld.com. So final thoughts on the main event tonight. Night. How many stars? Where do you go? I, I, I have to. I have to watch it again to give you a cop-out answer because it's, you know, being here. I mean, it, the crowd was electric for it and everything like that. But um, I mean, I know that I've already seen Twitter, so I know that anything under five stars, I'm going to get killed for. Yeah. But, but I, 
I also know that I have to watch it again. There you go. Just to say that. Well, I appreciate your time. Thank you so much, Dave Meltzer, for joining us. It's been great. What a night here. And, of course, we return to the United States and to San Francisco and the famous Cow Palace. The world-famous Cow Palace oh, where I grew up. That's going to be great. Yeah. Uh, July the 7th. And we look forward to seeing you all there. And uh, we'll talk more about that, of course, in the, in the weeks and months to come. So, for Dave Meltzer, I'm Kevin Kelly. Thanks for joining us here on the Post Game Show and JPWWorld.com.